Hey traders out there in Trader Land, my name's D7 here at Grok Trade. It's hump day, Wednesday, May 9th, 2018, and the markets go bullish almost a full percent. Everybody up here, actually NASDAQ up more than 1%. However, Russell's only up a half a percent, a little laggy there, but financials make up for it up one and a half percent. Crude oil up 2.2%, gold slightly lower, silver slightly higher. VIX, though, dropping, fear dropping nearly 9%. Bitcoin higher by more than 1%, GBTC higher by nearly 2%. All right, let's take a look here at the markets. The huge move in today's market. We had a nice pop over resistance. This was a big move today. See this resistance, resistance. We touched resistance, we touched it there, and we busted through it. We put a buy back here on the 2nd of May, around 20. 262, 262, and now we're at 269 on that. Call diamonds, diamonds back here at 238, and now we're at 245, and up over resistance point. Very, very good move. Volume's not great on the breakout, not great on the breakouts here. NASDAQ up, 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 up. Tech stock's doing a very well. Broke through this area of resistance, still going higher. Had this at 161, and now we are at 167. A nice, nice move. Russell's 2000. Up, 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 up. We're at this resistance point right there coming across. And we had that at 155, and we're at 158. Financials higher, 27. Now we're at 28. Up, up, up breaking all sorts of resistance, closing above all major moving averages. U.S. dollar up, 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 a little laggy. It looks to toppy to me. Crude oil, we have a buy here at 13.88, and we're at 14.35 area. Gold, I got a buy on it at 126, and we're at 124, so we're down on that one. Silver. We are up, we are at $15, and we closed here at $15.52. Whoa, I'm gonna put a sell on this one, guys. I'm adding a sell on silver, so we'll sell it at 15 and a half. VIX, got a sell on it at, say, and we're at 18, and we're now at 13 and 0.6. And we're below the 200-day moving average. Interesting. Really, really low there. Bitcoin. Bitcoin. Let's go to Bitcoin. I got a sell on it. But it looks like it's getting ready to bounce. So that could bounce. Let's see if it does. Quick look here, guys. Just a quick look at Dow 30. Any big movers of interest? Um, we have to look at Apple just because we, we always do or we try to. Got a buy on that one at 165, 165 to 187 now. It's like a, is that a 52 week high? It, man, that almost. I mean, if we get past this area of 187, that's gonna be, it's, gonna, it's looking pretty good. Check out Boeing. Got a buy on that at 3.34. We are at 3.44. 10 points on that. Caterpillar up 1.8%. Wow. Have a buy at 1.43, and we are at 1.52. Um, CVX, Chevron. Whoa, this one's a big one. Here we have a buy at 1.17, and we are now at 1.28. Disney down 1.8%. Have a buy on it at 98, but it's now at 99. It had earnings that gets a sell. Okay, we're gonna sell it. So we got a little bit of profit on that one, but not huge. Whoa, DuPont up 2.8. Oh, and it busted past a resistance area. Very, very strong here, guys. Have a buy here at 64, and we're sitting at 66 with a lot of upside potential. GE, are you kidding me? 2.45% in the plus. Have a buy on that one at 13, and we are at 14 and a half. GS, Goldman Sachs up 2%, are you kidding me? 
have that one at 233 and now it's at 241 any others man another one up one point these dow 30 if anytime you're up more than one percent that says something oh i got this one at 51 and we're at 54 and jp morgan man up 2.2 percent have this one we have a buy at 107 and we're at 113 whoa merc man Merck is up over 2%. Got a sell on that one. That's going to get a buy signal now. So basically break even on this one. Break even. Microsoft up is up, 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 up. Got, got resistance coming up. Um, Procter & Gamble I have a buy on it, but we're right there at that down unh is down i got a buy on it oh man i'm gonna have to put i'm gonna put a sell on this one so i'm gonna put a sell on this one and we had a buy here so we're we gave back a little bit on that one that's utx got a buy on this one around 117 and we're at 123 area i'm not exact on the numbers you can go check those out yourself verizon down 1.4 percent i got a buy on it oh and it broke down yesterday should have been my sell i did not get my sell on that yesterday it's going to get one now underwater on that one walmart down three percent wow remember the buy and i had to immediately put a sell on it and look at this so we have a sell on at 85, and it, now it's at 83. We got, ooh, this one, Exxon. We got a buy at 76, and we are at 79. Okay. Man, this was kind of fun. Let's go to Grok Tech Stocks. Take a look at these dudes. Let's take a look at these dudes. Oh, man, we got a lot of movers on this one. And just before I do... For you guys here grok trade go down to scroll down scroll down take some webinars but here if you're in the midwest somewhere join us We're doing some meet and greets i want to meet you guys look at my shirt add kicking in <laughs> i used to be a frankfurt hot dog a mascot for our our frankfurt indiana um, high school was hot dogs. <laughs> Crazy, isn't it? Crazy. Um, let's get back to this. All right. So um, Amazon, no, we don't care about Amazon right now. I mean, that was making us a ton of money. 1460 and we're at 1606. That's a money maker. All right. Let's see. Anybody else want to look at? I'm going to do 2% on this one. Whoa, look at this dog. Facebook, we got a buy at 159, and we are at 182. Google, a buy at 1024. We're at 1082. Same thing on Google with an L. Let's see, anybody else I want to look at? NVIDIA, 2%. Boom, we got a buy on the breakout at 233, and we are at 255. 255. Shopify is up 1.95. That's close enough. I mean, I should look at the other ones, too. Got a buy here at 120, and we're at 146. Man, big move there. Let's just quickly look at PayPal. Got a buy here, boom. Oh, and it broke back above. That's really, really good. Red Hat, got a buy breaking up, and it closed at the day's high. That's very, very good. Okay, Twitter's up almost 2%. Take a look at that. Got a buy at 30 and 32. Okay, monologue time. It's going to be short. Here's the deal. Wednesday is my racquetball day. I don't play tennis. I used to in high school for a short amount of time, but I bought tennis rackets for me and my family, for my family and me, to be grammatically correct. And I'm gonna start playing tennis also. Do any of you guys play tennis? Anyway, I'm gonna wrap this up because I'm gonna go play racquetball tonight. If you think we can help you, if you think your trading would be better with our training, which I'm telling you it will, that phone number, Text us. Text us your name and email address. Name and email address. And we'll talk to you about 
education opportunities where we can teach you well, all this stuff. That's why I put my buy and sell signals. I want you to see the caliber of what we do. Uh, Mark the Meerkat, who is our primo mentor, instructor, does our chat room. You would be just blown away by his profitability for 2017, and we are on fire in 2018. This stuff can be taught. Anyway, that's it. Take care. All the best to you guys. If you like it, like it. Share it. Sharing is caring. Catch you later. <laughs>